Let's get salty! Everyone, Zeddy here again with another gameplay video, and we are reporting or showing off games from a deck that appears to be a real meta breaker. It's super toxic. You're not going to like it or facing it, but the wins you can get with this deck are just gross, and it's all around Zilliax, which we talked about earlier today. I talked about this whole build in that video where you have power module at the start of your turn, double this minion's attack, and you give it stealth, elusive, poisonous, and reborn, where your opponent just can't deal with it. Most decks don't have ways to interact with it, and you can tutor it with pit stop, which not only it gives it a buff, it goes to four attack, so it amps up even faster. You can re-stealth it with spider, and then of course you have from the scrap heap, which can give it wind fury and all those shenanigans. So yeah, you kind of go all in on that strat, which I if you took a look at my record with the deck in the short time I played it, really solid, and I didn't draw particularly great in a lot of those matchups. And if that for some reason can't get you to the finish line, you can just reload with a horse stone brew and give yourself a fresh hand. I never got an opportunity to play it. I wanted to highlight it, but I just kept killing my opponent. So yeah, really gross deck, very few minions in it. So you can reliably tutor the good stuff with dig for treasure. And it's just all cycle, all removal. And um, it's a pretty darn disgusting deck. So just thought I'd highlight it. And if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Have a great day and stay salty, my friends, or stay stealthy. All right, Death Knight. <sighs> See how we do against this. So this is, yeah, this is like the new hotness of a deck. Stick Zilliax and kill your opponent. But the win rates are actually promising. Um, a lot of decks just can't deal with it, and it's very tutorable, so... We'll see what we can do here. Actually played one game before this. I thought I was recording, and I beat a warrior, which is like our worst matchup. They just straight up couldn't kill the thing. They just couldn't do it. Alright, so Pit Stop's a great way of, uh, getting your Zilliax reliably. And it gets a buff, too. So, it has Stealth, Elusive, Elusive Poisonous Reborn can't kill it it's kind of a problem so we're looking at plagues here they don't have a tremendous way of dealing with it from my understanding um i think we just kill this cycle if we could hit oscillator i think that's what it's called yeah oscillator could get it out next turn might be worth the prep if i get oscillator i can yeah i'm gonna prep this all right i didn't hit it but I think it was worth it, worth the, the, the thought there. So yeah, you're running just mostly spells. Very few minions because you want to hit specific stuff. And because you have a card like Dig for Treasure, which if you draw a pirate, you get a coin. Um, they got hell yeah. You don't even really care, right? Like, it doesn't really matter to you. Man, I, I, I don't know. For some reason, I just do not like the plague cards. They just kind of bug me. They're just not fun, man. Anyways, this is not going to be fun for our opponent. We're going to make him make him sad. So we can get lifesteal on this thing. Yeah, and the idea is it's stealth. It gains double attack. You attack in. Maybe give it wind fury. Attack again. Give it stealth. And a lot of decks can't remove it, but he's going to be able to play probably his giant rushers immediately, but it does have stealth, so. We'll see how that goes. They didn't get the plague. So right out the gate, 4-7 elusive. It's going to have 8 attack next turn. And you can just choose not to attack with it. And they don't have a good way to interact. A lot of decks can't kill it. But Horseman is a card, so we have to be aware of that. But you also have Spiderbot in here, the Spiderer, to help you um, give it stealth again. Oh, we drew a Plague immediately. Again, my favorite. Um, I mean, I feel like I just get it to, f I could get it close to 15 even. And then you have burn in the deck too. You have saps, removal. I, <laughs> he just gave up. It's like, I can never deal with this. He just gave up. I'm thinking what I should do. Oh my God. That is, that's probably not cool. So two and oh with this deck. I wish I got that first game recorded, but yeah. It's pretty good. Let's see if we can keep going with it. All right, we got a druid. No idea how we're going to line up into this. I think we just keep Oscillator. Like, it's not bad. It's on one. We find Zilliax. It's cheaper. 
I love the fact that Stonebrew's in this deck, although from what I've looked at in the numbers, it's absolutely atrocious in this deck. I don't know what people are playing for Druid. I know there's been um, not really spell damage Druid. There's been Highlander, but there's this dragon build where people just try and randomly get the uh, the the priest time warp card, which is pretty absurd. But yeah, we're uh, gonna try our best here to find that Zilliax. They could, I guess, the Wall of Taunts. We can like pretty much much never get through. Although we have Tarslick, which Enables more than you would think sometimes. And we're probably going to want to keep it with Fan. Yeah, we're just going to keep trying to rip through our deck here. Very one-dimensional deck. I don't know if I really love this deck, but I did want to try and highlight it because there's not a lot of rogue stuff going on. And we talked about Zill, but oh my goodness. Yeah, this is going to be rough. Minion heavy decks. How dare they play minions? I don't approve. Yeah, this is looking really awful. So we can deafen. I'm playing deafen in a deck. What what universe is this? So I think we tar slick that. We hit here for four. We draw. I mean, I might, I, I kind of want to save the fan. I might end up using both, so. No, well, let's just fan. And try and find that Zilliac. It's just, <laughs> this deck feels so hopeless when you don't draw that one card, but you have some tutors. You have two two tutors, basically. Dig for treasure, pit, and particular pit stop. Just kind of always works, but. Yeah, we're not hitting what we want to hit right now. Dude, I don't know if I've seen that animation yet. Oh my goodness. Well, that could be a problem. Alright, give me Zilliax. Where are my Zills? Where are my Zills? Alright, what do we got here? I guess we just start developing. We'll do it the good old-fashioned way. So they got 10 one mana legendaries in their deck. This might be rough. Especially in the top deck, the perfect one off the top. And I concede instantly. Yeah, I mean, they could just play Dragon Golem and, like, I can't deal with that. It's probably what's gonna happen here. No, just more random dragons. Oh boy. Yeah, they could sometimes randomly get the priest uh, time winder and take an extra turn. But I think we're pretty screwed. Like, we just whiffed on what you need to get, which is obviously Zilliax. Alright, well, let's try and kill them a good old fashioned way. What does this get? Wind Fury here. That's 16 damage, that seems fair. It's like almost lethal. Alright, let's hope that they uh, don't have an answer and don't have taunts and don't have lethal. These are all things we can reliably dodge, right? Totally, we got this. This is so stupid though. Win or lose, this is just dumb on our part. I hope my opponent wins. <laughs> Like, this is stupid. Alright, what are they doing here? Dragon Golem? I mean, they would have played that last turn, no? Weird. Can I kill them through this? I can sap. I don't think I can kill them through it. I don't think so. I can sap one. This, this. I'd, ha I'd have to random something with gear shift or something. I mean, I'm dead always this turn, so we just have to hope for the best here. Like prep plus something. Yeah, that works. 
That that works pretty well. Who needs Ziliox when you have non-interactive garbage? Oh my god. So I guess you know just need Ziliox. Man, is Wind Fury maybe a problematic mechanic? I don't know, but that sure seemed fair to me. All right, the true test. Can we beat a Demon Hunter? I don't think we're favored. <laughs> I don't think much is favored against it. And uh, we're really bad at drawing Ziliac so far. So yeah, if we get like, I'm mulliganing pretty aggressively for like Pit Stop in particular, right? Like that's just a great way to get it. And Demon Hunter does not have a great way of interacting with Zil at all. But they also just murder you, <laughs> so there's that as well. Um, yeah, if we get if we get Zill, we can play it on turn three, and then just try and kill him in a couple turns. I smell golden in their water. We'll see what we can do here. Dig for treasure. I don't think I play it yet. I might prep it next turn. We're gonna hit probably. They're gonna play their weapon. They literally never not have it. It's it's scientifically proven. Oh, he doesn't have it. I, I was gonna say it's scientifically proven that they always have it, but it's playing study, so I'm not quite sure what that means. Studies. He runs glacial shard. Maybe it's Reno. All right, we got the uh, pit stop, so we're gonna prep that. Get our Ziliax out because it's four mana and next turn he'll have eight attack I'm gonna hope he can't reliably answer it and then we just kind of kill him in a couple turns isn't that fun might be the way to go but yeah this uh if this uh, ends up being like a strong deck it's gonna I feel like it's gonna be a problem what there's a rat it's gotta be a, a reno variant right I feel like it mean it's got to be a Reno one. So already eight attack. They're not putting a ton of pressure on here. So we can just hit in. Let's hit in. We're going to draw. We're going to draw again. And I guess I can just play this. And then re-stealth this. And it goes to uh, 22 attack next turn. That seems good. I don't know how Demon Hunter interacts with this, like, at all. Yeah, I'm really not sure. Let's find out. <laughs> that that doesn't do nothing when I'm not holding minions. <laughs> it's the saddest cartridge I've ever seen. Uh, 22. I don't think we have lethal here, do we? I have 22 plus 5. What's it? What can I get from here? Uh, deadly poison? I mean, we just... Hit face. Ah, oh, so close. I mean, do I just attack now? No, that's no fun. We gotta wait. We'll save the sap because we don't care about that. Or or do we just hit in now? Like, what's the punish for leaving it as it is? And again, is there anything I should care off of this? Not really. I feel like we just leave it. Like, what are they gonna do? There's no way to interact with this for Death Knight. Or Demon Hunters. Oh, there's the punish. He happened to discount a Yogg. Oh, it's still for one turn. Why didn't I hit? I'm an idiot. I'm actually an idiot. I totally forgot. There's a reason, you dumbass. It only has self for one turn. Oh my God, that is a, that is a fail. I totally forgot. There's so much stuff on it. I couldn't tell. Oh, no. Well, that certainly uh, does the trick. <laughs> yeah, I, I probably should have attacked. Let's try this again. Oh, no. That's embarrassing. 
Good thing it's not like I'm gonna post this on YouTube. I'm just gonna cut this game. No one will see it. Nobody will see it. All right, so it's 14. Yeah, he's still dead. <laughs> so stupid. It's so dumb. Breaking the meta with Hearthstone Brew. Are we ever gonna play it? It's probably just not even the correct card in here. I play this game to absolute perfection, all right? Unity, perfection, precision. Oh my God, yeah, I'm uploading this one. <laughs> so bad. And we still won. Oh no. All right, we got ourselves another druid. I feel like I just hard mulligan uh, for pit stop. Like I really do. Like it's all about Zilliax of this deck. It is so one dimensional, but I, I think it has to be the way to go. I've been keeping like quick pick, but why keep it when you can just get another card, right? That's the idea. Like, yeah, you draw it, then you play it and draw. I faced one dragon. Yeah, we faced that one dragon druid earlier. That was kind of absurd. Uh, we'll see what we can do. But yeah, druid does not have like ways of dealing with it at all. So if we can, if we, I mean, well, we didn't even hit the Zilliax last time. We just built a stupid spark bot because Wind Fury is fine. All right, we got. It's like drum circle, maybe that would be bad. All right, let's see what we got. But I've I've lost one game so far. I brick completely against a warlock. And other than that, we've won almost every game. It's been going well, but they're gonna ramp here. I mean they if they're Reno, they can certainly deal with it with Reno. That is absolutely a very much a thing. Alright, we are not getting what we want here. Let's draw. Player Oscillator. And yeah, we might have to just make do with a different mech. Let's see what happens here. No Nourish, at least. That's a positive. Can't Nourish me. Yeah, so far Hearthstone Brew has basically had no say in any of these games. Alright, he's leaving a mech up. So, I think it's time to build a mech. Let's prep. We got three spark bots. We got a stealth one in there. Um, play that. Get some more spark bots. Try and get like wind fury. Never win Fury. All right, well, good Divine Shield. Reborn. And unfortunately, we didn't really get the one that we wanted. And I guess we'll give it Stealth. But no win Fury might cost us here. Dragon Golem might come down. Reno might come down the next turn. All right, so it's... No, we still don't know if he's running... Hard running dupes or not. All right, we quick pick. We'll silence this. We're gonna hit in. I think I just play all the magnetics and just hope that he doesn't have Reno and just try and kill him with burn. I think that's my only real option here. Time to light a fire under this town. So it's definitely a Reno build and we're going to hope he doesn't high roll this and immediately get the two mana spell. All right, that is pretty useless. So yeah, this deck does have some versatility, I guess. With like just going in on spark bots, going in on spider, because stealth is fun. Imagine we got wind fury, this game was over. Like that that's pretty ridiculous. Alright, he got something. What is that card? Okay, so we keep a 2-1 and a 1-1. One, one. Oh, we don't keep anything. 
thought we would have had a 1-1 one, one there. Um, so I can get two deadly poisons, which is four. It's one off, even if I had the mana. And he random some armor gain, or is that just in his deck that he random that? What shall I do? I could hit with a deadly and hope to get eviscerate right off the top, but I don't think that's a good idea. I guess we just play another stupid <laughs> stealth guy. And uh, hope for the best. This is some fun and interactive gameplay, I must say. I was going to point this face, because why not? Where else is it going to go? But I might get clustered here. And I don't think I'm getting through that. Let's heal for six. Can you feel the gift? I don't have spark bots. Dude, I've been drawing... I cannot draw Zilliacs. This should be so easy if we could get a Zill. I guess we just cycle with fans or build a dagger. I might do that. No dragon in hand. So I can sap that. All right, there's Zilliox. Right on time. So he goes to eight. If he draws Reno, we, we always lose. But yeah, just uh, weird draws. I'm not getting this consistently for whatever reason. This has stealth for one turn. Wonder what he zills or what he ETCs here. That's fine. That's not great, but I guess it's fine. Does this get stealth or like does it come with stealth after? I don't even recall. I right, hope he doesn't get another taunt. That's fine. Like, does it come back with stealth? It does. So I have 8, 11. 8, 11, and then I can Deadly Poison? I think... Do I have the mana is the question. I do. My goodness. This was a tough one, but yeah, this deck... Seems to be working. I don't love that it's working, but... Seems to be working, kind of. The Hearthstone Brew has been like completely irrelevant. I would like to highlight the game with it, but uh, yeah, we just kind of kill him before that. We just kind of kill him. All right, we got a mage. I don't know. I, I keep feeling like I should try and just find Pit Stop. It's the only card that seems to matter. Uh, Mulligan stats do seem to think this is all right, but I don't know. I feel like I should just find it. Like, this against Mage, I can't get it out earlier. I'm gonna trust the numbers. We're gonna go with the stats. And by the way, if you're not aware, this is like a premium. You have to have like H's Replay Premium to have the Mulligan stats on your screen when the game starts. Um, I use H's Replay Premium all the time, especially like I have stats and stuff I show um, on my videos, but yeah. If you're wondering where that comes from, that's where it's from, and it's all right. Eventually they'll find a way that, uh. The game will just play itself for us. All right, look at that tempo. We got him. Tempo good. Get to push that two damage. I could even slap the stealth on it. Not too worried about that though. I could honestly do it. It's not the worst, but how about I draw Zilliax once ever? There we go. Early Zilliax finally. So how does a mage deal with it? They don't have devolving missiles. They can't free, I guess blizzard? It's our I mean, you can random a spell from discovery of magic. They get absolutely random me. Um, I mean, I'll draw first. Yeah, turn three, Zilliox. It's not buffed 
from pit stop, so it's going to take a little bit longer. But next turn, we can go, like, prep scrap heap, throw some stuff on it. So that might be glyph. And yeah, they might just randomly freeze and... I'm just trying to think of the stuff they could get. There's freezes. The only one that not targets is Blizzard. Um, that'll be interesting to see what happens here. All right, let's see what we get from this. Obviously, Wind Fury is like what you want. We didn't get it. All right. Um, so I can slap this on. It goes to seven and then give it stealth and it goes to eight and then it's 16. Dang. I just then I don't have a way of stealthing it after that. So we might not want to do that. But I, I want to ramp it up, right? So I think that's what we're going to do. And right away, we're like threatening lethal on turn five. They haven't, uh, vaporize isn't available, but oh, there's star power. I didn't think of that one. All right, we can give it reborn again. Unless he's got another way of killing it. Okay. Yes, I didn't think of that spell. Of course he gets the perfect spell! Blizzard! Alright, um, it's probably gonna blow up, so let's draw. Okay. So let's give it Reborn again. Rush. And then again, we stealth it. Fun. Does he have another way of interacting with it randomly? Well, let's find out. Uh oh. Oh, he's going for it. Does he get star power again? No, random secret. So probably barrier. But 18, that uh, technically keeps him alive, right? Barrier? I go, he goes to 18, he goes to 21. No, we have lethal with deadly poison. Uh, don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Ah, uh, he's dead. That was fun. Yeah, this, this deck seems just kind of disgusting. But, uh, yeah, it's, um, it, it's kind of working and it's kind of gross. So if you're looking for something else to play, another fun interactive deck! I think I lost two games total, um, playing this off stream. Didn't play Hearthstone Brew once, but apparently it's worth running, so there you go.